Alright, hello everybody. Um, alright, in the first video you learned how to do some basics. Now, I'm gonna show you how to texture. And maybe some more crap if I have time. So, hit E for edit mode. Right click, map operations. New map 128 by 128. Alright, now, um, the first thing. Well, there's four things you can texture. There's the ground, right here. There is walls. Then there is ceiling. And then ceiling extrusions. Now, to do the floor, you hit insert and delete. And there's about 250 textures. Um, so, yeah, you hit insert to go up and delete to go down. For the walls, you hit home and end right next to it. So home will cycle through up, end will cycle down. For the ceiling, it is page up and page down. And for the ceiling extrusions, it is seven and four on the number pad right there. I don't have numlock on. I don't think it makes a difference though. Well, that was pretty simple. So, now that you know how to texture stuff, I'll show you how to add some map models. To open up the map models menu, you first gotta click where you wanna make your map model. So, I'll put it right in the middle of this blue square. And this red thing right here will say where your map model is going to be so this would be the middle. Now I right click for the editing menu, go to the first option, map models, and they give you a bunch of categories. For my purposes I'm gonna do street and then I'll do dumpster. Okay so you can make a bunch of like, crap just by adding map models. Now, to add lights, you go to the second option, lighting, and then they give you white lights and colored lights. White light, and then you can choose your radius and brightness, so if you, if you have a small radius, it'll be a small light, but you know. Then if you have a bigger radius, you can do bigger lights. And for colored lights, um, choose your radius again, how big you want it. And then you can do some colors like a red light, or you could combine red and blue to make purple. You can, yeah, you can make your map really interesting with colored lights. Alright, and then if you want to delete things, you'll notice the blue orbs, kind of sparkly thingies above them. These are all entities, and to delete them, well the nearest one that you're close, or the closest one is going to be orange, the other ones are going to be blue. And to delete them, if you hit backspace, it'll delete whatever one is orange or your nearest to. So, hold down delete. And to get the lighting back, you go into the lighting menu and you do full red. This will make your level completely lit or not. Now for entities, you can say where you want people to spawn. RSVF is, or RVSF is blue. This is red team. And then, free for all, you can choose where you want to place the flags, right here, and you can, ladders, alright, I'll explain ladders. Ladders are actually two parts, they are first the actual ladder part, so I want to place one right here where the red square is, and then... So you go to map models, 
they go ladders or stairs. I'm gonna do ten. Yeah, let's lower this. Mm, one. Okay. Ten. So that's the first part. This is what makes it look like a ladder, but you can't actually use it yet. Now, to make it an actual ladder, you gotta go to entities, ladder entity, and then you choose its height. This, this one is 10. And you'll see there's two orbs up here. They're uh, right on top of each other. And this will make you be able to climb it. So that's how you do ladders. And clips make it so that you can't um, walk wherever they are. So let's make like a high clip. Boom. Alright, so there's an invisible wall right here. 